There's another one in now for Port Adelaide. With pick 60, Port Adelaide have selected father-son nominee Jace Burgoyne from the Eagles. And he's a player, Peter Burgoyne, and now his son's at the club. Uh, repeat story, hey. A champion of the game was, was Peter, uh, Indigenous mm. Team of the Century. We yeah. forget that now with Sean, his brother, being such a wonderful player in more recent years. But Pete was a star, 240 games there at Port. Uh, this boy's a player. I'm shocked he's not bit upon. Just the, the naked eye watching him play. He's got exciting pace, steps around him, kicks it well, comes from half back again, but also can get up through the midfield. Yeah, well, it's been a long wait. Um, obviously, tuned in from the start, so um, yeah, it's funny. Pretty, pretty exciting to be here at Port now and um, for late to be over, so yeah, happy. Yeah, it's um, a very special moment for the family. Well, I guess um, the family that are here have been here since uh, day one, so um, it is pretty special. Um, myself and Sean played at Port Adelaide. Uh, Trent was there for a couple of years, so um, it does make it like a little bit special. Well, he's frighteningly like his old man. It, it's uncanny. I kept watching the vision over and over and over, and. Like Shifter said, it's it's hard to see why he wasn't bid on because it's just his composure. But Peter had this knack of putting the game into slow motion and and so is Jace. It's just that ability to take your time. Almost looks like he's got an extra two or three seconds than what other players have around the ground. Yeah, I guess I pretty much grew up on uh, going for him when I was growing up. So um, yeah, it's pretty, pretty special to be going to the club that obviously uncle and dad played at. So, um, obviously, I wasn't too sure if there was a bid going to come in or not, but um, I pretty much knew um, I was going to report. They pretty much told me they'd match a bid, so um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just happy to be on board.